Okay, quick hot take. What do I think about Chapter 2 Remix? First of all, the event. I don't think it's an event. I don't think it counts as an event. I think, for what it is, it felt more like a Party Royale event than it did a finale to a chapter. I don't think it was good. I don't think it was the worst. I think there's been worse events. But I don't think this is a good event. I think it was pretty bad. It was a, it was pretty much a glorified live stream than an event. There was effort put into it, but not enough where I count it as a Fortnite event. As for the Chapter 2 remix, I personally dislike what they've done with it. The celebrity collabs have nothing to do with Chapter 2. I keep seeing people bringing up this argument saying, Oh, well, it's called Remix for a reason. Like, you guys should be more grateful. Now, here's the thing, and I want to explain this to you guys very quick. When Chapter 1 Remix got released, all the new skins we got and all the slight changes we had in the map, it, it, well, that's if there were changes put into the map, like, and changes to the event, so on, so on. All of it was related and within Chapter 1. Nothing, like, it, it was nothing outside of Chapter 1. It was all within Chapter 1. I'm going to repeat that. It was all within Chapter 1. It was all related to Chapter 1. Nothing outside of Chapter 1. No new collabs with celebrities. No this, no that. It was all Chapter 1 related. So, why shouldn't that apply for Chapter 2? Because you guys seem to keep bringing up this argument about it being a remix season and that it's supposed to be different. But, that, okay, fair enough. But at the same time, if that's the case, then shouldn't all of the changes to the map and the weapon pool and the collab skins, shouldn't it not all at least be within chapter two? Like, for example, would it not make more sense to do a remix skin of, let's say, Travis Scott or Ariana Grande or just collab skins that were within chapter two in general? And then even the weapon pool. Like, wouldn't it not make more sense? If you're going to, like, add weapon pools that are related to celebrities, wouldn't it not make more sense to make a weapon pool that's related to those collabs that were within Chapter 2? And then, let's talk about the map changes. They took, they took a lot of iconic places, such as the agency, the shop, and then added this other place and called it, like, they made it into, a, like, a, a spaghetti restaurant. Like, let me just, like, what, what does any of that have to do with Chapter 2? It doesn't. It doesn't have anything to do with Chapter 2. In fact, personally, I think they should have saved all of this for Chapter 6. I think all of this should have been put into Chapter 6 instead. And I think Chapter 6 Season 1 should have been a celebrity-themed season instead of this being shoehorned into Chapter 2. I, I know you guys like to keep making this argument where it's like, oh, it's a remix season. It's supposed to be different. It's supposed to be new. Stop crying about it. But it's Chapter 2 at the end of the day. It's supposed to be Chapter 2 related. Everything is supposed to be within Chapter 2 like they did with Chapter 1. And... The fact that they're just shoehorning all of these collabs with like these celebrities such as Eminem, Snoop Dogg, and Pink Girl, I forgot the name of. I don't even remember her name. Was it like Ice Spice or something? They have nothing to do with chapter two. They really should have been saved for the next chapter. And I don't understand why Fortnite like Epic Games and Tim Sweeney thought it was a good idea to shoehorn all these collabs within this remix season. It just doesn't make sense. Why not put more effort into making more remix skins for the item shop instead of like putting the effort into making collab skins? And then one more thing. I know that some of you guys like this new feature that Epic Games have at has added, but personally, I'm like very mixed about it. They decided to add shoes into Fortnite, meaning if you want to put a pair of Knights or Adidas on your Fortnite character, you can do that now. You could purchase a pair of shoes and literally put it in your Fortnite character. This is what they've done with like Fortnite today. Like this is modern day Fortnite. What worries me about it is one, it's just more money to spend and just more collabs to add to the game. Two, wouldn't it not just make the UI more clustered than it already is? Because I don't know about you guys, but I think the UI looks the worst it has ever looked in Fortnite's history. Compare the UI today to the UI back in Chapter 2 or in Chapter 1 or hell, even Chapter 3 maybe, and then compare it to the UI now. It looks really messy and outdated and just, even though I've gotten used to it now, it still looks really bad and I hate the way it works. The item shop in my opinion, I preferred the item shop when it was smaller and more simple looking than the item shop today, where it's just full of skin after skin after emo after emo after, with like just so much shit to look at. And it's like, I don't know. I just don't like it because the UI itself was also very messy. Then the locker. Don't even get me started on the locker. 
Remember when you were able to um, save like a preset for like a skin where you could save the emotes and the raps and the edit style and the bat bling all in one preset? And it was very clean and simple to use and there was nothing wrong with it at all and it didn't need changing whatsoever? Why did they change it to what it is now? Because what they've done, and I really don't like how they've done it, is you now have to save each preset separately. So if it's skin related, that's separate. If it's emote related, that's separate. If it's rap related, it's separate. That, in my opinion, is way more messy and clustered than what we had in chapter two. There was nothing wrong with the chapter two UI. I know why Epic Games has made these changes. They want to keep the game fresh and updated and that's fine. But there was nothing wrong with the chapter two UI. If it's not broken, don't fix it. Don't change it because there was nothing wrong with it. I don't know if you guys will agree with me, but personally, I don't think there was anything wrong with the chapter two UI. It was perfect. If you wanted to give it a new cleaner look, then fine, you could do that, but at least keep it the same because there was nothing wrong with it in the end of the day. And then back, back to chapter two, I'm just, I'm just worried about like what the experience is going to be like with this like new season we're getting. I'm still somewhat excited to play it. Don't get me wrong. And I'm going to be more than happy to play it. But it's just, they, they took like the whole purpose of chapter two remix was it was, it was all supposed to be chapter two related. And now it doesn't feel like that anymore. It's, and it's an absolute shame. Like, that they've taken something like this that was supposed to be so special and they just decided to turn it into a huge advert for these celebrities and shoes and, like, change the map and add, like, these weapons. Like, don't get me wrong, some of them looked kind of fun. Like, the Eminem one where it's, like, when you shoot it, it's, like, saying the lyrics to his songs. Like, that was pretty funny, but it has nothing to do with Chapter 2. Like, why not save these collabs? for like chapter six and then another thing that frustrates me is the way the skins look they don't even suit the style of chapter two at all like they they look so out of place dude oh i don't know i'm just i'm just like kind of frustrated with what they've done like there's a lot more i could say but that's pretty much my like opinion on what they've done in a nutshell I don't know if you guys will agree with me. Like, you could go ahead and disagree with me if you want, but like, I just don't like it. And then one last thing I want to say is this is probably the most split I've ever seen the Fortnite community as a whole. Like, I've seen other people make videos. Like, for example, there's this one guy called Pro Zero. He made a video called This is a Disgrace Fortnite Remix Rant. And personally, I agree with his rant. I think everything he says, like, I like is very true, and I agree with him. But like, everyone in the comments are just insulting him and calling him a man-child or a seven-year-old or telling him to quit the game or go outside or tell him to go fuck himself. And it's like, guys, this man, he's simply sharing an opinion on something that he cares about and is passionate about. Why insult the man? In fact, isn't you going out of your way to insult him and to call him a loser and to like say all these insults to him? Doesn't that make you more childish than the guy making the rant video about why he doesn't like these changes? I'm just saying, like, <laughs> it's quite frustrating. And if you guys are interested in watching his video, I am going to leave a link in the description if you guys want to watch his video as well about the, his take on, you know, Fortnite, like, Chapter 2 Remix. But I just don't like how split the community is looking right now. I think it's really frustrating to like read all the comments and tweets that have been posted people are allowed to have an opinion just like myself i am allowed to have an opinion and post it onto youtube and tell you guys that i am not a fan of these changes and i think that a lot of the stuff that is new should have been saved for chapter six and that is my opinion and i should be allowed to have that um but that's my overall take on all of the changes they've made let me know your opinions in the comment section below. I would love to read your guys' opinions. I might even be replying to some of you guys if, like, if I have time. But yeah, that's my overall opinion. I just think that they really should have just saved a lot of these changes for Chapter 6. And they should have just stayed true to Chapter 2. And any anything new should have been, like, within Chapter 2. Like, any new skin, any new weapon, blah, blah, blah. 
it should have all been chapter two related staying within chapter two that is my take thank you all so much for watching and i'll see you all in my next video